few uh, utilities and companies tackle the entire SCADA platform from top to bottom. Um, and we have done that and we've done it across the water and sewer networks, which is a, approximately 5,700 square kilometres of uh, asset and infrastructure. One of the key benefits that was previously they could only see and monitor, whereas now that they can see, monitor and control the station, and that's one of the, 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 the key differences. I think the bigger picture is that the new SCADA system, and we've seen it already, has given our operations centre the ability to diagnose faults in the network, such as blockages, and we've been able to prevent sewerage overflows and uh, surcharges in particular instances where the operations centre can see what's happening in two wells and, and interpret what is actually going on, that there must be a blockage, and we've been able to respond and prevent overflows. The customer contacted the call centre and reported that there was a large amount of water surging out of a nature strip. Um, when we checked mapping, um, we saw that it was quite close to a pump station that pumps sewerage. Um, so I managed to get in contact with the customer who lived nearby and um, I asked if she could go out into the street with her mobile phone um, and we confirmed where the water was coming out. I stopped the pump and asked her to give me some immediate feedback the problem with this station was that it was quite close to a sensitive area in a creek that runs to the ocean. So it was absolutely essential for us to be able to stop that flow uh, and this system gave us the information and the ability to do so. SCADA tells us where the problems are in our network and we use their vehicle locating system to get the best crew to the problem fastest.